Yo, how's it going guys? So, I've been playing a lot of Call of Duty and I recently reached max prestige so um, and I did, I was like grinding, I was basically grinding as soon as I would hit level 50 and uh, I would prestige right away so I'm a little, a little worn out of Call of Duty and of course my channel is supposed to be a channel of various different games and uh, over the over the Christmas break, I bought uh, Assassin's Creed Unity. I know it came out a while ago, and there are already you know walkthroughs of the game by other channels, by more popular channels. But hey, you want to see a hardcore gamer or or a kid, which is what I consider a hardcore gamer, play play this game. And I'm a big fan of Assassin's Creed. I've bought all Assassin's Creed ever since Assassin's Creed 2. So that's six Assassin's Creed games that I have. And I've enjoyed all of them. Uh, I heard that not too many people were happy with this one, that there were quite a lot of bugs, but hopefully we will not be disturbed by any of that. And I think my favorite one was probably Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. And it seems like all of these things over here, it looks like those are D DLCs, and, but I never played any of, any of the DLCs for any of the previous Assassin's Creed games. So I know who that is, I know that's Etsy, and I know that's uh, what's his name, Connor. And then I don't really know, and then of course I know Ed, Edward Kenway. I don't really know who the rest of these dudes are. But uh, let's, let's get into Assassin's Creed Unity, man. Last of the heroic Knights Templar, Jacques de Molay was a man of principle, a towering intellect betrayed by those he trusted. In this episode of Fallen Heroes, experience Jacques de Molay's final tragic hours through the eyes of one of his closest friends and advisors. Okay, last of the here. Okay, I'm not sure. Okay, wait. Okay, so I can't go back. Apparently, I think this is probably the story. I don't know. This is the first time I'm opening Assassin's Creed Unity, so I guess this is what we have to play. Let's see. Last of the Heroic Knight Templar. Okay, I now I'm assuming that this guy's a Templar just because it says Templar there. As you all know, it's always been Templars versus Assassins. Templars being the bad guys. So, but I don't know, apparently this guy sounds like he was a good guy, so I don't know, maybe he's an assassin and it's just called the Knights Templar. But I guess we'll find out. Let's see. Play. Okay. I don't know. Let's see, let's see. I think Assassin's Creed Brotherhood was the best game because it was just, just you had so much to do and I loved the Leonardo da Vinci missions those were really fun like the bird and the tank and I don't know what else okay I'm gonna be quiet now but, uh... look at them graphics oh them graphics who goes there a friend of the temple Shlalrak. The Council's message was absolute. You're not welcome here. I must speak with the Grand Master. He's in session. They all are. Another day, perhaps. King Philip disagrees. Damn you, man. I have no idea about what's going on. Why you're not rotting in a cell at this moment, I cannot fathom. Oh, what? It just kind of like jumped there, but apparently he just killed him. Okay, okay. Just lagged there, like in one of the scenes of action. I hope that's not one of the bugs that people were saying were annoying, but... Um... We are betrayed! Draw your swords, men! Defend the temple! Not you, brother. I have a different task for you. Is that, is that the Knights Templar dude? Is that the one that was in the picture? Is that the guy who was in the picture? Oh, maybe not. King Philip's moving faster than we expected. Mm -hmm. Okay. Jack de Molay. Wait, wait. Just a second, guys. I'm just going to check the graphics. Graphics, 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 blah, blah, blah. Where's graphics? Reload. Uh, what? Options. Okay. Uh, graphics. Here we go. Aspect ratio, that's fine, yeah, that's fine, yeah, that's fine, yeah, that's fine, I guess that's fine. Graphics quality, high. Is there higher? Ultra high. Okay, let's just leave it in, in high, just to see how things go, and if it's, if we're getting some good FPS, what's advanced graphics? 
high, high, high. Okay, everything's in, in high. Let's just leave it as it is, and if we're getting good FPS, then we'll, we'll change it later. Assassins. I thought the Mongol Khans broke their power decades ago. The assassins are far older than Masia, my friend. Their anarchic delusions are very little to play. Less easily around. Um, I think I know the controls. Maybe not. We will not prevail this night, but if you make haste, we may yet save our order. What must I do? Go to the tower. Take the sword and the book. Hide them. They must not fall into the assassin's hands. Okay, so these are the... Grandmaster, I know. Okay, so these are the Templars. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Free run. Attack. Who do I attack? I just wanted to do that. Okay, let's see. I just wanted to do that. I just wanted to. Hold the bridge! Hold! Dad, I have to take a different way. Yeah, as, as your friend's getting killed in front of you, no worries, bro. Just, just, you know, chill. Okay, so. Okay. Fine. Okay, can I open this door? I guess not. I guess I go this way. And I'm assuming I can just climb up. Come on, jump. Climb leap. Okay. Wall eject. What does that mean? What does Wally Jack mean? Does that mean I jump off the wall? Well, oh, oh. Free run down. What's this? Oh my god. Okay, so Wally Jack is that you jump off the wall. Okay. Where do I go? You know, I, I, the graphics, the graphics are good, but I still feel like they haven't really improved much, like significantly, from previous Assassin's Creed games. I was an assassin. Run faster! Oh wow! You come back here. What does free run off? What's free run down? I don't know, they don't... They're supposed to teach the controls, man. Come back here, you thief. Oh. Okay, so you still counter like that. Dodge. Dude, I said dodge that. What? What the? Get in the way! Chase him! Yeah, the graphics don't look all that impressive, honestly. Why is he so slow at swinging his sword? Oh, get. Oh, that sword looks badass. Oh, is that my sword? Oh, it is my sword. Oh, shit! He can shoot lightning from his sword? Wow. Okay.
the sound okay it seems like the graphics are definitely behind the sound I don't know why that's always been a problem with the Assassin's Creed games or well, at least on, on PC Wow, that was a silly way to die after kicking that guy's ass. That was very... Seven years later. Pope Clement, hear me? Before this year is out, you will answer for your crimes before God Almighty! And you, King Philip, no punishment is too heinous for the great evil you have inflicted upon the temple! I curse you! Curse you to the 13th generation of your blood! You shall be cursed! <laughs> Consumed in flames of hunger and wrath, thus came the age of true wisdom to a blistering close. The Knights Templar, once the proud shepherds of order, peace, and illumination, were no more. We know that's not true. Yeah, let's get a sniffer running. If Abstergo pings us, pull me out. Okay. Okay. I have a visual. Hey there. This is probably disorienting, so I'll be brief. I'm Bishop, not my real name, obviously, but that's as much as you'll get today. Please listen carefully. Abstergo is using you, hijacking your neurons to help them sift through genetic memory data. These guys don't have their fingers in countless corporations, governments, media outlets, and NGOs. But now, they want control over history itself. If that doesn't frame you, it should. But we're here to stop them, and I need your help. Deacon, preload gene sequence, uh, AD-16, B-13, I-87. Yep, spoon it up. Is that Lucy? That's her name, right, Lucy? Last week, we gained access to a bank of unsequenced memories in Abstergo's Helix servers. For now, we'd like you to experience a small sample. This should help you understand our struggle. And after that, you can decide for yourself what comes next. We'll be waiting. Am I still the same guy that I was in Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag? I don't remember what happened to me in the end. Like, I remember, like, I was hacking into the system or something, and then... Um... Uh, like, I know how the story ended, like, the pirate story, but I'm talking about the, you know, about the dude whose genes were being explored. I don't remember what happened to him in the end. But I remember he was in contact with Lucy and, uh, the British dude who's always been there. The funny one. Okay. Versailles, 1776. Oh no. I know he's the assassin though. Can't I go with you, father? Courage, my boy. You wait just here. I will return when this hand reaches the top. That's forever. Not as long as all that. And when I get back, we'll see the fireworks. And Arno, no exploring, hmm? Yes, father. I'm really not that impressed with the graphics. I mean, the everything else except the, the people looks great. <laughs> The lighting, the, the the walls, the paintings, the furniture, but the characters themselves. I mean, it, it hasn't really improved much from the last last Assassin's past Assassin's Creed game. <laughs> He's got a girlfriend. It's going to get him in trouble. Of course, we have to follow the girl. Okay. Here, let's take, let's take, uh... Would you rather sit without, Prune? Come on! I'm coming, wait. Wait, I'm coming, I just want to look outside. 
I was I was in the palace of Versailles um, uh, in uh, November, actually. Uh, the gardens were still being reconstructed, though there was still some construction going on there, and it was pretty cold, so I didn't stay outside very long. But I mean, it was a beautiful place. That's something I always liked about the Assassin's Creed: how it takes you back, you know, back in time to historical moments. Okay, so I can run. Yeah, so like the characters. Yeah, the characters are like basic. Like I'm not, I'm not impressed. I am not, I'm not running the game in ultra graphics. I guess. I suppose that has something to do with it. Maybe if I run it on ultra graphics, it'll look better. We'll see, I'll just I'll just play a little bit and if if I'm getting like really good FPS, even in like the crowded places, I'll bump up the graphics. I'm I'm using the GTX 870M. That's pretty. Uh, I haven't checked the, the benchmarks for the graphics card with the Assassin's Creed Unity. But it's it's the three gig version, not the six gig version. Let's see. That looks amazing, man. So pretty. I love admiring the scenery of these kinds of games. Bet you can't steal one. There, see, woman, man. Woman, they just get you into trouble. How do I steal? E? What? How do I steal? Come on, man. Take the apple. How the fuck do I take... Oh, there we go. So I have to be standing in the right spot to press E. Thief! Put that back! Break your pursuers to create the last known position. Okay. Ah, uh, hell. Go, run! What happened? Do you know what the penalty is for stealing? Got you now! Okay, now. These are for His Royal Highness, not the likes of you. Funny, it's like goes around the bush, then gives up looking for. Oh, wow! Goes around the bush, he's not there. Stops looking for me. Oh, whoa. I'm ordering you to stand still. Follow me, man. Yeah, come, come, follow me. You're my uh, me stealing an apple deserves your attention. Okay, there. Now he's distracted. Now I will run behind him, as if he didn't have the brains to assume that that would happen. Hurry! Through here! Did you see their faces when we stole those apples? I stole the apple, <laughs> and you ran away. <laughs> I'm Arno. Elise. I'm here with my father. So am I. He has important business with the king. What should we do now? Shh! <gasps> Listen. Don't worry, they'll never think to look for us in here. She touched my lips. That's what he's thinking. It was my fault. I'm the one who took the apple. Nobody cares about your apple, bro. Let's see where they're going. Only that guard in the backyard cared about your apple. I don't know why. Hurry up! Monsieur Franklin. I sincerely hope this unfortunate affair does not darken your opinion of our nation. Monsieur, if we judge nations by the character of the Father, we should all uh, come here, girl. Oh no, please tell me my dad isn't Father? dead. <gasps> is my dad dead? I bet you my dad is dead. Yeah, he's dead.
That's sad, man. No tears? Where are the tears, man? Thirteen. That went fairly at cards, so you stoop the thieving, you bastard! Calm down, Victor. I've only come for my watch. It's my watch. I want it fairly. Well, in a just world, Victor, I would agree with you, but this is not a just world. This is France. You're a dead man! Ooh, step lightly there, you'll hurt yourself. Ah! Ooh, he's so strong. Just had a nice chat with your brother. You go. Fetch the marshals. Hold on a minute. Diable. On goal, Victor. Diable. Now. I'm coming for you. Sorry. Can I run faster? What? What did that say? Pardon, madam. I guess I'm already running as fast as I can. Slide under. Oh, look at the, the, the Gentlemen, please, look at how an nimble and agile I am. Please excuse him; he's not housebroken. Definitely a lot more crowded. How do I tackle? E. Oh crap! Come back here. I'm coming for you. Get wrecked, bro. Thick-headed blacksmith like you probably can't even read a watch. Come over here. Yeah, that was unnecessary. Uh, no. Get back here! Over there! I want to run up here. Keeping up. Shall I call a break? Go, go, go. Where do you go? Okay, fine. I, I wanted, I just meant to jump. Where can I become anonymous? Is there like a haystack somewhere? Oh wait, maybe in there? Go to the De La Serre estate. Okay. I wanna, I wanna try out the... I want to try out the, um... Oh, I guess I'm already here. And where in God's name have you been? Ha! Huh. Got you now, you little shit! Just a little misunderstanding, nothing to... Your master's arboring a common criminal. In broad daylight, he broke into my home and stole my watch! Did he indeed? Well, I'm sure the Marshal C would be more than willing to sort this out. Sort what out, Olivier? Uh, a most serious accusation against your ward, sir. He robbed me. <laughs> of what, precisely? Wait for me in my library. I wonder what he said. Probably just gave him some money. Don't give me that look. Victor cheats when he plays Pharaoh. Everyone knows it. Arno? Who are you talking to? No one, monsieur. You'll be happy to learn I persuaded Olivier to leave off calling the Marshalsea. Again. Je vous remercie, monsieur. What is this? The sixth time? The seventh? Perhaps a new hobby might be better for your health. Well, I find playing cards affords many opportunities for fresh air and exercise. <laughs> we'll talk about this later. I have business in town and must collect Elise before I can attend to it. Elise is here? Only for the night. She returns to Paris first thing tomorrow. She'll need an escort. Won't she with you so preoccupied? One of you running amok is quite enough. Remain here and see if Olivier has any chores for you. I'm sure he does. What was that? Give my regards to Elise. Memories of Versailles complete. 
Um, okay. I guess I am going to stop the video here and move on to the next part. Yes, I will pause the video here and then I will resume. All right, I'll see you guys in the next part. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope uh, the, the game has sparked your curiosity. You've probably already seen it, but who cares? It certainly has sparked my curiosity. Anyway, see you guys on the next game. Next episode. Blah, blah, blah. Bye.